All right, let's play some, um, should we play some Dungeonborn? Let's get some gameplay in. This is part of Steam Next Fest. The demo is out just for a couple more days. I think that's closing their free like demo play test thing uh, on the 12th, I think. I think so. Um, but this is a dungeon crawling, looter extraction, PvE, PvP type game like Dark and Darker. It's clearly inspired by Dark and Darker. Um, which I hear is still putting out a lot of updates, um, but it's no, it's not allowed back on Steam yet because of all of the ladies and gentlemen on 83 month reason bogata pride bogata pride bogata pride less than three thank you so much Sammy. she tried to scare me in the window uh thank you if i'm saying your name wrong please correct me feel free to correct me Uh, two I got it right. A semi. Okay, cool. Welcome home. Thank you. Did you get coffee? Can you do me a flavor when you have a moment? Oh. Can you bring me some some new water? Thank you. Dungeon born. Um, yeah. So it's like um, uh, this game seeks to do some similar things um in the looter extraction field and uh, i've only played i don't know i've probably played less than 10 matches look at the art of this oh man it's so good and i'm having a lot of fun with it what's for breakfast i haven't had breakfast yet i don't know my guess would be eggs and like avocado or eggs and fruit Let me show you guys real quick the classes you can be. So you got fighters. They give you like a little list of pros and cons, right? Um, you get both of the skills that they list here. I know it makes it look like you're picking one, but you get both. And then you can pick what passive skill. Over here. And right now they only have male character models in the game, but this is like early access, like play test. Oh no, maybe they do. Oh, they no, they don't. I never saw that in the middle. See, we figured it out together. They have both. <laughs> I just assumed I made a wrong assumption when I was making my character because I didn't see it anywhere. All right, there you go. It's in the middle there. Um, We got priests. Okay, buffing allies, healing allies. Because you can play this multiplayer. You can you can queue up with friends. Um, the rogue. This is the my my char my main character is a rogue so far. Um They're really cool. You know me, I like I gravitate more toward beefy fighter types, but the rogue in this is excellent. I started with the sword master. I thought it was cool to have like psionic blades and this whirling blade ability. The way that the psionic blades works though is a little weird. You actually have four swords in your inventory slots that act as the ammo for this ability and they give you four extra in your actual backpack. So you have lim less backpack spa space until you use this ability. And then if you use all eight of your psionic swords, then unless you find more swords in the dungeon, you can't use that ability anymore. And I just didn't like that. Yeah. Um, Pyromancer. So kind of like a, a fire wizard. A death knight. This you um, unlock. I only had to play a couple matches before I unlocked it, but this isn't available your first like go through. And then uh, same thing with the Cryomancer. These are the two undead characters. So this is more ice spells. So there's our uh, 
cast of characters here. So you can see I'm only like level five on the rogue and level four on the swordsmaster, but let's empty the, enter the lobby. Uh, there's already daily quests in this. They, they are very generous with um, the gold. There's a whole bunch of events when you log in that you can, uh, every day you log in, you can get something else like given to you for free. Like if you log in for two days, you got the cryomancer that this is how you got these three days. You get the death knight. Um, but you can see I have 20,000 gold and I've only played less than 10 matches. So they, they give you lots of stuff to play around with. Right. Thanks yes, for the sir. water, babe. You're um, I just got last night. I just uh, escaped. So you can see I have a whole bunch of stuff. I got to sell. Let me sell and then we'll start another run. If you guys have questions, let me know. Uh, I am not an expert in this game, but maybe we can figure it out together. Do do do. Sounds good. Let me go to my stash. All right, now I want to take Tank these golden wings and take two heals and I only have one bandage. Alt. I guess I can go buy some. And how are my my daggers? Slightly magical. Maybe I can buy a crossbow. Can I buy a crossbow? This is from other players. Yeah, 950 for a crossbow. Let me buy that. And then the merchant has bandages. I need bolts. Twelve, ten shots. That'll be good. And then bandages. One. Are those 400 each? Oh, Jesus. Christmas. 400 gold for a bandage. He lets you make stuff. Maybe I should have gone here and make stuff. Oh, look at that. I could craft it for 240. I'm a dummy. Oh, well. Okay. So potions are eight life per second for 30 seconds. Bandages are restore 240 life, but it's a six second cast time. I never picked up my crossbow. Okay. So I spent all this time equipping so that I can lose this all like in 30 seconds in the next run. That's how this game works. Yeah. All right, you guys want to try? Let's let's give this a shot. Hi, troll. Yeah, learn to fly again. It's a great Mr. Song. Mr. Mr. Song. A potion is still twice as much hit points in total. Fliffo, is that right? I'm not good at math, so I never did figure that out. Okay, so they have... This is a team of three. This is the team of one. And then there's training rooms and stuff. This this map that they've made is absolutely incredible. All chests and monsters drop one extra piece of loot. Like the the design of the map, how it looks, it is insanely good. There's no fall damage either. So you can like jump off of walls and stuff. All right, so um, 
one of the things I love about the rogue is how like thief it feels. Um, that wasn't really a good example of it, but um, you can rapid fire your little dagger shots, and they don't do like like typically in in any kind of fantasy game, right? The thief character attacks quicker and does like le a lot less damage than something like a warrior using a two-handed sword. But in this, just being able to like mess things up really fast, it's really satisfying. Come on now, load in. Where's your textures? There we go. No, that's the wrong thing. I thought we were gonna start off with a mimic right away. Okay. So we have a really nice map. There is a circle you have to stay inside. We are dead in the center. So all good there. Uh, my abilities are Q. Uh, allows me to turn something to stone so I can get away. I've used that to get away from other players a whole lot. And E is flat out stealth. Go invisible for a few seconds. And the first shot I think that you make when you come out is a crit. These creatures are part of a bounty system they have. They don't attack you. They're they're a little tanky. Um, they do have loot. And then they track how many of these you kill. And you can get rewards for it. Four strength, five stamina. I, I hear another thief. I hear a thief. I can tell by the stabbing. Shit. I don't want to fight another player yet. You know what? I don't want to be anywhere near them. Oh, you son of a bitch. I, I probably don't want to waste all my crossbow shots on this, right? Oh. <laughs> Get the shit out of me, by the way. New helmet. Plus two weapon damage. 9.3. 8.2. Sold! I'll hang on to this for now. Sorry, he's laughing at me. That's a, I haven't tried to kill one of these giant treants. I don't know if you guys have seen this guy. Look at this guy. That guy, ah, oh, no way. No, oh, thank you. Okay, I thought I was gonna go meet him <laughs> for a second there. Let's go vanish. Oh shit, I found another one. Not a good time. No, it's not good. Oh, this is not good. I aggroed a whole lot of stuff. A mosquito. And he got me. I got got. Incendiary flask. Oh, that is a really good amulet. Six dex, six strength. Holy crap. That's a nice, that's a spicy meatball. Smokescreen flask and a ring of dexterity. Wow. Okay. All right. That goblin can't get to me. There's some AI work they need to do. Uh, monsters can't get to you sometimes. I feel like overall, like the average monster is not very threatening to like even, like in Dark and Darker, like 
the skeletons attack so quickly and unpredictably that I oftentimes would find, because I stink, that I would take damage while fighting them. Come on. Don't turn your back on me. They die with creepy faces. Please don't be a mimic. Oh, good. Amethyst. Some more rings. This is 7.5, 4.9. Eh, it's not really great. About the same as what I got. Silver goblet. Silver goblet. You can see in the top right who's killing who and how much life they have left when they do the kill. Which is interesting. 300 value replica. No, not even a replica. Golden beer mug. Yes, please. This horse sells for 40. Takes up a lot of space, though. All right, where do we want to go? All right, we're heading kind of the wrong way. Let's head this way. Should I break some more barrels? Anything good? I'm not even in the castle. Like, this map is so big. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> well, there goes whatever streak we just had. <laughs> Out of nowhere. <laughs> Can you tell I'm not as used to streaming? Holy crap. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, man. Hey, an extra crossbow. Well, sorry about that, gang. <laughs> I was already like that. Wow, it was 423 days? That is a long streak. That was really long. Oh well. You see what I mean about how fast the, um, the rogue can fight, though? Ooh, this wanderer's vest is interesting. Hell yeah. Wow. That is nice. I'm running out of room, though. I gotta get out of here with that, that chest. Is that streaming days? No, that's not streaming days. Oh, that's another person. Goodbye. I will endeavor to live another day. He found me. I heard his footsteps. All right, so you see the portals are starting to appear. That means we can escape if you find one. They do something a little tricky in this game. Where, um, when you are activating a portal, it takes a long time and it pings the map while you're doing it. Unless you have, I think it's called a relic. There's a certain item you can have that hides it. I, um... I think I gave that guy the slip. I 
hope. Um, I'm not great at PvP. And that guy was fully armored. <laughs> the only problem I'm having is there's no environmental sound. It's dead quiet when you're not making sound music with help. It's there is environmental sound. It's crickets and insects. I'm not sure you can hear it through the stream though. But you're right, there is no music. Somebody killed the giant tree. Oh no. So now he's frozen. I think I went around in a circle. I don't know where to go or how to get away from this guy. Got to get to the circle. This is back in my little hiding hole here. He probably saw me. I bet. I'm dead. Juicy drinking sound. That was my nickname in college. Hoping now I gave him the slip? I feel like I went far enough there. But this is what I why I really like. I believe this is where I started. Funny enough. This is the exact area I started. Can I get out of here? This is why I really like the um Yeah, this is exactly where I started. How funny. Um this is why I like the, the thief. I can get away even if I am not able to uh, compete sometimes. I gotta find a portal soon. I do, but I um, like I don't want to go back down there. That's where the guy was. I feel like I'm stuck here though. How did I? How do I get over this? You think a thief would be able to jump over this? Hmm. Double jump. I know, right? That's what I want to do. There's no way to kill him. Um, I don't know if you saw. He hit me like once, and I was almost dead.
have to get back inside. Where I am on the map is terrible. I'm going the wrong way, but I don't see another way. Oh my god, here we go. Holy shit, that scared the hell out of me. It's a ghost. Another one? Please don't kill me. Okay, good. Cheesy peasy. Very low health. So now you can spectate. This is the only guy left. Everybody else was gone. So there we go. Look at the art on this. Ugh. Every time I say look at the art, it goes away. Alright, I'm level six. Beautiful. So, we have some spoils. Sturdy gauntlets I can sell. Sell the beer mug. This was great. 300 gold for this one. Um, and everything else? No, I can sell this, this, and this. Everything else is stuff that, if I die, I can use to replenish my goods. So let's stash all this. I have an extra crossbow. Nice. All right, this is a shielding push. Maybe we'll take that with us. We'll take our 10 bolts. I'm gonna take Uh, one, two bandages, and we're gonna take two health potions and one shielding. Looks good to me. Is there anything else we can pick up? Events. What do I get? All right, so this is the pest bounty, those little crazy creatures. Because I killed 10 of them now, I get bonus three potions. Nice. So I like, I like that there's like little things to log in and do and rewards to pick up. Let me make sure I put these back. Yeah, look at, it's gone. All right, let's play again.